What's going on family? It's your man Miami Patron and I'm here for another video like always. Now right now I'm currently coming from Los Angeles. It has been a long long day. If you haven't seen my Instagram right now I'm currently at the Bob Proctor consultant training. So I started working with Bob Proctor. You should have seen this already on my last videos but he had a training here in LA which is why actually I haven't been to Medellin. And what I want to share in this video is this. How over the last two weeks Weeks, my life has completely changed now Bob Proctor is the person that's really facilitating this but it was actually a decision that I made probably back in October so I'm gonna get real personal with you guys share some stuff that I haven't really shared before and stuff that quite frankly most people are afraid to share so if you guys have been following my channel especially over the last couple years you guys have known that I have started many many businesses you know getting started with net, uh, almost like network marketing right with life insurance with Primerica back when I was 19 years old and one of the things that I've been struggling with over the last couple of years is I would I, I start businesses right I would start a business whether it was network marketing or Shopify or Amazon or any of these things you can literally look back through my channel either my YouTube channel or my Instagram and you can see all the different businesses that I had launched over the last couple of years and you'll notice that I had success in every single one of them whether it was social media marketing and I was teaching how to get clients or I was um, launching an Amazon business and we were doing you know we did fifteen thousand dollars our first two weeks or any of the businesses you could literally all the YouTube all my YouTube videos are talking about the different businesses that I had started and quite frankly over the last couple years one of the things that I have been struggling with was actually diving down into the business and taking it to the next level where I have real success. I mean real success where not only do I leave an impact on people but I feel good about myself. Now what does this have to do with um, Bob Proctor and actually the event I'm at right now is this. I knew that there was something inside of me that I needed to change, right? There was a level of awareness. Now this awareness came from listening to Earl Nightingale's The Strangest Secret. I would listen to this thing over and over and over again. This is back in October, right? Uh, when I got when I got back from Colombia, And I would listen to this tape over and over and over and over again. And at the time I was wondering, you know, why isn't my life changing? I, 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 wrote, I was writing my goals down and things weren't really working. But what was happening to me at that point, which I didn't realize, was my level of awareness, right? And, and it wasn't something external, right? I was looking for something external. I was looking for another business. I was looking for a mentor. I was looking for all these things outside of myself. But what, I, what, what was happening during that time was I was reflecting on the inside. And I was realizing that there was things inside of me that I needed to work on. Now, if you are into any kind of personal development, you know that they say you have to work on yourself, you have to work on yourself. And that sounds good, but what does that actually mean? And not until I got, I intercepted Bob Proctor's material that I actually understood, understood what that actually meant. And I knew what I could do to actually make those different changes. So one of the programs that I'm in right now, or the program that I'm in right now, is thinking into results with Bob Proctor. And let me tell you this, not only am I a consultant with him, meaning that I am a facilitator you know um, selling the program but I'm actually a, a, a student of the program and I'm really noticing changes in my life when it comes to this I had a paradigm if you don't know what a paradigm is let me, let me let me show you a paradigm is a multitude of habits it is literally the way you run your life your habits the way you greet yourself the way you present yourself the way I present myself on this video right I have I have this confidence where, where I, lo I love getting on YouTube videos that's just a, a, a voice that I've played in my head where I just feel confident making YouTube videos where other some of my closest friends are afraid of that that's an example of a paradigm. So let's get back to what I was saying. I had a paradigm where I would start businesses and I would do for you know three months, six months, nine months, 12 months, get to a certain income level and then I would drop off. I started noticing different habits, whether I was doing Amazon, social media, uh, Instagram marketing, consulting, whatever it was, I would make money and I'd go and I, and, I, and I would fluctuate. I'd make it fluctuate, make it fluctuate and it would average out. And I knew that I had to make a change. And if I knew how to do it myself, I would have done it already. So I had to seek out a mentor and working with Bob Proctor has completely changed my life. 
it has completely rewired the way I view myself, the way I view the uh, the laws of the universe, the way, I, you know, I thought it was just law of attraction, but it's so much deeper than that. It's, it, it's learn, understanding yourself, understanding how to reprogram to the goal that you want, to become the person that you want. You see, when we set a goal, it's not to achieve. It's not about having the Lamborghini. It's not about having the Balenciaga shoes and, all, and then traveling and getting the Rolls Royce. Now, granted, that stuff is cool. If you watch my channel, you know I like the luxury stuff, but it's not actually about that stuff. It's about becoming. And, and, I, and I can say this with confidence in this video, which is why I'm sharing with you guys, that the person that, I am, that I'm transforming to, right? I call it Patron, right? Dion 2.0 that is this is actually what I am seeking and I feel the spirit my, my spiritual self right my inner perfection right we have infinite potential and I feel like that is actually truly starting to be one I'm aware of it number two and I'm starting to realize it and number three I'm progressing towards that and that is because of not not just you know listening to a seminar or or, or, or you know watching a couple YouTube videos right I've watched this stuff on YouTube but until you invest Invest in yourself until you actually start working with a mentor like I decided to work with Bob Proctor because he started talking about stuff that really resonated with me right there's tons of noise on social media but one of the things that is this guys for us to reach the goals that we set first of all we have to know that they're the right goals but to reach the goals that we want to set and actually feel good about ourselves <laughs> We have to reprogram our self-image. We have to reprogram how we feel about ourselves, how we think about ourselves. Back when I was doing network marketing, one of the uh, youngest million dollar earners, one of the most successful people in the company, uh, his name was Mario Arizon. And one of the things he said uh, stuck to me, and this was like years ago when he said this, but it still stuck to me, stuck to me uh, this day. And he said this, the person that changes the most will see the most change in their life. And it's, like I said, it sounded good, but when I started working and, and going through Bob's material, I started realizing that literally the way we program ourselves and we're, habit, we're habitual, us as humans, but instead we start making active changes in our life, in our habits, in our thought patterns. We might look at our external results and, we, and if we don't like it, it's literally just a reflection of our past choices our past res our, our past behaviors a lot of the times we look at our weight we look at our income we look at all you know our team all these different things and we don't like the results but you can't get mad at that and you can't be down on yourself but what you can do moving forward is begin making those changes in your life begin making those behavioral changes and what Bob teaches is not about changing just your action, because remember, thoughts lead to feelings, feelings lead to action. It's about actively planting your goal, whatever it is you're working for, into your subconscious mind. It's not about just reading it one time. If you're like me, you've probably read Think and Go Rich, and probably not, probably a couple times. You remember in chapter two where he talks about um, desire, right, the six steps? I probably did that like three or four times throughout my life, right? Everybody, every business, everybody said, go read Think and Go Rich. So I read it, I read it, I didn't study it, I read it. And I, I would write that six, those write six things out. But then a month later, I would stop. A month later, I would forget about it and I just would stop. But now that I'm un actually understanding how to plant an idea in my subconscious mind, I understand the concept of why it's important to use repetition, to use these concepts that Bob Proctor teaches to plant that idea into your mind. Because like Earl Nightingale says, you can plant a seed of corn or you can plant a seed of nightshade. Each one of them, if you give it the energy, will grow into its fruits. So then we have to sit there and, we, and if we look at our results, our, our results corn, where, where it provides nourishment, excitement, self-fulfillment, you look in the mirror, you're excited, or is it nightshade, where it's disappointment, uh, you look back at your results and it's not happy, like me, when I would start all these businesses, right? It, and, and I would just fail six months later, and I never knew why. I would make money, lose it. Make money, lose it, but I never understood why. That was the nightshade. But then learning the material that I'm learning from Bob Proctor, I know why I need to use repetition. I know why and how to plant my goal, my desire, 
into my mind because there's a source flowing to and through us and to begin changing my life and our lives. Guys, this is just sharing what I felt like today in my testimony of working with Bob Proctor. This is just day one, and more videos are gonna be coming out of what I learned. I have some cool guys coming on that are gonna be teaching sales and, and different stuff about, uh, about stuff that you guys are interested in. But other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Miami Patron, out.